Common for residents or business owners to cover the cost of emergency medical services, but that is about to change in western Lancaster County. With a unique approach that only a few in the Commonwealth have done. Evan Popalish joins us now from Elizabethtown with more on this story. Evan. Valerie Alicia Northwest EMS will cease operations on February 4th, leading the way for a new EMS agency called Mesa to come in and take over, all being funded by people who live and work in the area. Northwest EMS, just like most of the emergency services companies across the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, have been struggling financially. Leading to a new movement, the end of Northwest EMS and the beginning of Mesa, or the Municipal Emergency Services Authority of Lancaster County, which covers six different municipalities. The municipalities have been meeting with Northwest EMS for multiple years, going back at least five, six years. To try to find a long-term solution, their answer, have Mesa be publicly funded. Every property will be assessed a fee. Homeowners and business owners will be charged a fee around $85 annually to help pay for Mesa in East and West Donegal Township, Kanoy Township, Elizabethtown Borough, Marietta Borough, and Mount Joy Township. Even renters and apartment complexes may have to pay up. So it would be the same fee for apartment buildings so that the property owner uh, we'll get that fee and then it's up to the, the, the landlord to determine how they're going to, to assess that fee to their tenants. Debbie Dupler is the chair of the Mesa board. She said that around 17,000 mailings went out to properties in the six municipalities. But when we checked in with businesses to get their reaction, most of them told us they hadn't heard of the new EMS or fee involved. Businesses will have to pay around $10 for each employee they have, and Dupler says there are about 800 businesses with three or more employees in the affected region. I think people don't understand what has been happening and what is happening. They don't understand if we didn't do something, our emergency services were going to be going away. This is unique to, to Pennsylvania, um, and a, a unique approach to emergency services in Pennsylvania. And people living in the six mentioned municipalities should expect their bill to come in the mail the week of February 19th. In Elizabethtown, Evan Mapalis, ABC 27 News.